everybody. Um, today is the oh does um today is like of, like official day one day one of me um animal sitting for my uh, parent in laws and one of my soon to be sister in laws pets in between my parent parent in laws and soon to be parent in laws and one of my soon to be one of my sibling in laws out of them I'll be uh, animal sitting for about six animals we well, roughly so I am dropping off a letter and right before I right before I drop that letter off I've already drove passed to my soon to be pair in laws and it looks like that they are like in the like about to leave soon so I'm not gonna worry about um their pets because I know that they're taken care of already for the morning situation so now I am about to go check on one of my sibling in-laws, one of them. So, uh, my fiance, he has two older si siblings and then two younger siblings, so he's like the middle child. So I'm watching one, um, one of the younger siblings' pets. So, now I'm heading over there to check on her pets. She has uh, three dogs and one bunny. So that's just from one person or one area. And my parent-in-laws has two pets or two dogs. So yeah, so I'll be taking care of six, five, six pets. So yeah. And not including my own, of course, but, yeah. So, and today when I'm recording this, I do have to work in the afternoon for a few hours, so, yeah. <laughs> I will touch base with you guys in a few minutes. And I just want to let you know that it is, like, not even 9 in the morning it's like 8 35 ish so I'm just making my first um, rounds like now with all of the you know pets and whatnot so then I know at least I've been there at least once you know today I'm not saying I won't go there more but I'm just you know saying as long as I made the first round with the basics first should be good and they have everything that I need to kind of go by I guess or as long as I have a B and C I don't have to worry as much so kind of thing so yeah <laughs> so I am on the way to my soon-to-be sister one of my sister-in-laws so Yeah, my fiance, she, yeah, I almost called him she, whoops. He has one older sister, one older brother, and then him, and then two younger sisters. So, I will touch base with you once I am there and whatnot. So, I'll see, see you in a few minutes again. <laughs> Even though I said that, like, not that long ago. But I'll touch base with you guys soon.
sign with green letters in the area. There it is. I see it. I was like 50 feet ish. I will touch base with you in a couple minutes. Okie dokie, now I am just leaving. I spent about 10, 20 minutes there. Just let, let them run around a little bit in the house so they can get and whatnot. Let them outside for a little bit. And so, Now they should be good for half the day or for a few hours, so, yeah. <laughs> so now they're all good, <laughs> so all fed, still have food, have water, so they're, they have their basic needs met, so they're good so far. <laughs> Now I'm going to touch base with you guys once I know what the plan is now. <laughs> I have no idea currently so I will be figuring that out in the meantime <laughs> what the plan is because I'm practically going to be pet sitting and working at my hotel job. Well I don't want it but and whatnot. so yeah. So I'll touch base with you guys pretty soon. Once I know what's what I'm gonna do next practically. <laughs> I'm probably gonna just drive past um my fiance's parents' place just to be safe. Even though I did saw them their car within the last half an hour or so. But, I'm just going to go past their house to see if they have left or not, just so then I know when I should go there kind of thing. Even though they're probably more likely going to text me saying, like, hey, we're about to leave, you know, letting me know. But, you know, I'd rather be safe than sorry, but I trust them and whatnot, so, of, like, you know, informing me and whatnot. But, it's good to be so safe than sorry. Right now, I am waiting at the lights because there is a long train. So, yeah. Now, I'm just sitting in my car, going on the way to, to my fiance's parents' place to help them out and whatnot. And, yeah, I'm going to be sitting here until I can actually go because of the train. And I'm going to be jamming out on some music. And I will touch you guys' base in the meantime. Okie dokie, right when I passed them is when I got the text message that they have left, so now it's official, six animals, seven if you count my own dog, boy, <gasps> dogs, quack, quack, oh, Hoo -hoo. that was a stop sign, there are some duckies, Somebody's yard. Quack, quack, quack. Oh, oh. oh quack, 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 quack. Quack, 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 quack. Okay, sorry. I'm being weird. Don't worry. I, I'm just as weird off camera when I'm with my, fr with one of my friends. Like, she always gives me that, like, WTF look every time I, like, I'm, yeah, so whenever I do those little weird things and whatnot, I'm 
way worse off camera with my friend. So, just thought you should know. So, yeah. I am trying though to be a little bit more relaxed on my vlogging channel and being more me. I'm not saying that I'm not me when I, I am vlogging, but I'm just trying to be more, put my personality a little bit more out there for you guys instead of like being scripted or at least being tense. I don't know. So I am trying to be more comfortable vlogging. So, just thought you should know. So, now I am. I am heading home. And, yeah. I. From my previous vlog, I believe. One or. Yesterday's vlog or the day before. One of those two vlogs. I brought up. I think, I hope, about my dog doesn't eat as much as he used to before his, like he, before he got his surgery, like before he got neutered, he ate all his dog food one each, during each meal time, <laughs> and now, like his eating is a little off, or He's not eating like he used to before getting neutered, if that makes any sense. And he's only eating whenever I have scraps of my food mixed with the mixed with the his food, but only is eating my scraps or my human food. So I don't know if I have to keep doing that or screw the food, not his food, and just feed him. He my food I don't, I don't know but because since the surgery the middle like on um, May 26th up to now he has lost about five four to five pounds so because he was about 74 75 pounds and now he's 70 pounds so I don't know so I'm thinking about I'm almost home but I'm thinking about cutting up some stuff or mixing some food. I've done research of him, not of him, but doing research of healthy foods for dogs that are human food. Human food that are good for dogs. And if I mix um, raw egg with his dog food, as if it's like wet food, you know, or carrots, or raw meat, or kind of like things like that. So, I'm thinking to give the eggs a try. So, I'm, I'm hoping to give that a try. If not, then I don't know. Because he needs to eat more than practically scraps of my food whenever I can't finish it and knowing I won't, you know, finish it later in the day. So, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm about to, I am driving on my street and I'm about to pull in the driveway. So, I'm gonna touch base with you. Oh, see you guys when I am inside. Okay, I practically just walked into the door. I'm gonna Go get my dog out of the kennel quick. So I'm gonna like crack some eggs, mix it with his dry food. Hi, baby! And try give that a try. And if that won't work, then I will figure something out. I'm gonna go grab his dog food that's in his dish or whatever, on a plate or whatever, and then put a couple um, eggs in it and then hopefully he will actually eat his food hopefully instead of protecting his dog food and not eating it I'm just sitting there and looking pretty <laughs> cuz my dog once he sees my mom's dog about to get his dog food he freaks the heck out and get protective so I'm going to give the egg 
thing. A try. Grab a cup. Grab the eggs quick. And whatnot. Mix it in here. And give it to him and make sure that he eats that. And I'll get back to you guys. <laughs> So I have mixed it. I don't know if that was what I was supposed to do or not, but I mixed it as if it was going to be scrambled eggs. And now I'm going to just dribble it, I am just assuming, all over the place. There we go. And hopefully now you'll eat it, hopefully. So I'm gonna put it in his little area and hopefully he'll eat it now. I'm gonna clean up that little yolk stuff over there and hopefully, maybe. Are you not gonna have some, buddy? You gotta eat something. Good boy. Eat. Well, I'm going to end the vlog here. I hope you guys like this video, this vlog video. If you do, please let me know by liking, subscribing, etc. And I will see you in the next vlog. Bye.